Hey, let me show you how you can use and adjust the free buttons shortcuts on the Redmi Note 13. So first of all, we have to go to the settings. Now we have to scroll and move into the home screen. Then we have to go to the system navigation and we have to actually activate the buttons. Now we can find the button shortcuts. And as you can see, we've got the long press the home button, or long press the menu button, or long press the back button. But also we've got the power button and the home, power menu, power back, or only menu. So um, when we take a look on each one, we can actually find some options like, for example, launch the Google Assistant, close current application, turn on the flashlight, show menu, or turn off the screen. And it actually looks the same for any button combination that you are going to use. So you can see everything we can find the same. Only, I oh know, never mind. I just thought that maybe here is a different, but it's actually the same everything. So if you want to, for example, quickly capture the screenshot without using the two buttons combination, you can go into the long press the back button and get, for example, the take the screenshot. Now take a look. This screenshot was taken. So we can actually get rid of this one. And for the long press the menu button, uh, we can actually get maybe the partial screenshot. This is actually the home, never mind. We have to go to the menu button. And as you can see, now we can capture the screen. So this is pretty cool. If you are using some, uh, some of these options, like really often, you can actually set these shortcuts and you can use them. Uh, but for sure, you can also turn them off either if you don't need them by selecting no. And that's how it looks right now. Please subscribe to my channel.